Good evening, everyone. Uh, Zach Edwards here with another story to read. This one is called Truck Stop. This is a really great one for my son. He loves cars and trucks and everything. Um, so with this, I'll start. Early each morning, the sun isn't up when we get busy to our truck stop, mom and dad and me. Our truck stop is right beside the main highway heading north and south. Every morning I squeeze the orange juice, dad cuts fries, sausage, and bacon, while mom starts off, starts up the coffee. Soon Uncle Marty turns on the lights in the service garage. Another good morning has come. You see that they're doing work inside. Uncle Marty's over here, turning on the service station. I love it when the trucks start rolling in. Our lights are bright in the dim, dark morning. I know each and every one of the regulars that comes to our truck stop. I love how they come rumbling their wheels and with air brakes whooshing. I love how the smell of diesel fills the air. You can see all the trucks are starting to come in. Eighteen wheelers is the first to arrive. Sam, his driver, asks Uncle Marty to check all eighteen tires. Good morning, he says to me. One coffee and bacon and eggs over easy, says Mom. You bet, says Sam. There's Sam, the eighteen wheeler. Milk tank and Lazy are next. The big silver tank uh, glows in the early pink dawn. One coffee and donuts coming up. I call every, even before Lacey uh, sits down at the counter. And there's Lacey and there's her silver milk truck. Diligent Dan's moving van is next. The usual? says mom. You bet. Sausage and pancakes, says Dan. With plenty of syrup, he adds. Where's Green Gus, says 18-wheeler Sam. Yes, where's Green Gus, asks Maggie and Dan. Green Gus is the old green pickup that rattles and clanks as it rolls but always gets there. Green Gus is always carting something here and there. But when is Green Gus this where is Green Gus this morning? No one has seen Green Gus today. So there they are eating around the table, and there's Green Gus. But where is he? Don't know. Not heading north, not heading south. There's all their trucks in the in the parking lot. Flatbed pulls into the stop with lots of loud clanking and whooshing, carrying digger to wherever needs digging. Orange juice, black coffee, and a blueberry muffin are what flat drivers always want. Now our stop is filled with a good smell of coffee brewing bacon frying, egg sizzling, sunny side up or over easy. It's filled with the good sounds of morning too. Hardworking friends talking before they hit the road again, heading, uh, some heading north, some heading south. Bacon, eggs, donuts, mmm, yummy. Pete and Priscilla's toke trucks uh, come next. Have you seen Green Gus? Everyone asks, but Pete and Priscilla say no. There's his pickup truck, his uh, tow truck. And there they are coming inside. Who's next? Suddenly, big yellow bus is here. 
Big Yellow Bus has come for, for me, as it always does, each weekend, weekday morning at the very same time. I pick up my backpack and run the, to the bus. It's time for me to go to school. See, there's the bus. And there he is, running off to school. Bye, everyone. On the old blacktop road through the uh, woods, I suddenly see Green Gus parked all alone on the side of the road with a very with a very sad driver. Please call the truck stop uh, to say I found Green Gus. I asked the bus driver, uh, and that's what she does. So there's Green Gus sitting on the side of the road, and there he is telling it, the bus driver to call the bus stop or the the truck stop. Pete and Priscilla's tow truck is on the way. They'll tow Green Gus to our truck stop, where Uncle Marty will see what's wrong and fix Green Gus. And the driver will have bacon and eggs sunny side up. There's Green Gus being pulled in, and there's the driver. Then all the trucks can go on their way again. Uh, including Green Gus. Tomorrow I'll say good morning again when they come to our truck stop by the side of the highway where the big road heads north and south. Again, there's the truck stop. There's everyone leaving. Bye guys! And here's a whole bunch of different trucks. This is what my son likes looking at. Everything from semis to ice cream trucks, to car carriers. They're all there, check them out. And just a few more. I hope you guys enjoyed that. This is actually one of the, the books that I like reading um, quite often, just because my son loves trucks and cars. So I'm glad I was able to read this tonight. I hope you enjoyed it, but it's time for bed. So good night, have a great night. And I hope to hear from you tomorrow. Take care. Again, if you have any comments, put them in the comments below.